Director, are the Russians interfering in our election right now? Well, I don't think we've seen any uh, ongoing efforts to target election infrastructure like we did in 2016. We certainly are seeing uh, and, and have never stopped seeing really since 2016 uh, efforts to engage in malign foreign influence by the Russians. Uh, so that's the use of false personas, uh, fake media accounts, social, social media stuff, the trolls, the bots, all of that stuff that's described at great length, uh, both in the ICA and in some of the indictments that have been returned since then. Uh, well, and so we that, that kind of effort is still very much ongoing. That's not just an election cycle issue, but of course now that we're in election year, it, it's an effort to influence our public in that regard. Does the FBI see the Russians amplifying content of certain campaigns uh, in the 2020 election? Meaning creating accounts or trying to create discord or, you know, not, not just in general political discord, but does the Bureau see an effort to try and help or hurt any particular campaign through social media amplification? I'd have to think about whether or not I could say anything in an open setting on that, but certainly I would say in general that the efforts to sow divisiveness and discord uh, on both sides of an issue uh, and to generate controversy and to generate distrust in our uh, democratic institutions and our electoral process, that's very much ongoing. Are other countries uh, also uh, capable of doing that or are doing that right now? I don't know that we've seen other countries trying to do exactly that. Certainly other countries like China, uh, for example, are, have very active malign foreign influence efforts in this country. Theirs is a little bit different than the efforts that I was just describing, but it's still very, very active and very serious. It's more geared toward, in their instance, it's more geared towards trying to shift our policy and our public opinion to be more pro-China on a variety of issues. We do know, we do know that other adversaries besides Russia are looking very closely at what the Russians have done uh, and taking note of it uh, and giving active consideration as to whether that's a playbook they should adopt.